Despite what certain people suggest here, it cannot be overstated how difficult and traumatic it was for ordinary working class or lower middle class parents to take abusive teachers to court. The parents almost always lost. And the newspapers attacked the parents in the most unpleasant ways one might imagine. Worse again, public opinion was always near 100% on the side of the teacher. If the teacher spanked the teen girls according to the rules above, there was zero chance of judicial punishment. And given that the internet has revealed the true extent of the spanko fetish, do any of us doubt that such schools were not a playground for deviant spankos?